Got some breaking news for you now. Yes, a new head of the United Nations has now been named and he's announced plans to change American communities. Now, they write here, according to the Conservative Tribune, they report that after a series of straw poll votes, the United Nations Security Council recently agreed that the Portuguese Prime Minister Antonio uh, Gutierrez would become the next Secretary General of the international body uh, and basically taking the place of the outgoing Secretary Ban Ki-moon, who is near the end of his second five-year term. Now, Gutierrez, uh, who is the head of the Portuguese Socialist Party, wonderful, a wonderful, devout socialist. He's ready to get to work immediately, apparently. Uh, his first order of business is to work on the international refugee problem. Now, according to a press release from uh, UNHCR just a couple of weeks ago, they announced its renewed commitment to dealing with the refugee and migrant issue with an aim towards bringing together a variety of governments and civil society to agree to provide better safeguards for the rights of displaced persons and a shared responsibility in funding those efforts. Okay, so this is how they're going to change our communities by forcing refugees into our nation, by making us shoulder the burden. Now listen to this. This is uh, they right here. This is what has been dubbed the New York Declaration. All right, remember that. Write it down, Google it, the New York Declaration. Now, in it, the UN called on member nations to resettle as many refugees as possible and for the wealthy nations of the world, hmm, can you think of a couple wealthy nations of the world? Oh, right, uh, the United States, mm -hmm. to shoulder more of the financial burden. Mm -hmm. Yeah, um, they, they call it humanitarian funding. Okay, which is required to make such efforts possible. They also state that the declaration proceeded to inform host countries that they must make all efforts, listen to this one, this is going to blow your mind, they must make all efforts to ensure that adult refugees are provided with jobs and children are enrolled in school. Of course, to be indoctrinated under uh, you know, Agenda 21 protocols and, uh, and, and Common Core right from the top of uh, the United Nations. Now, they write here, as stated previously, the incoming Secretary General of the UN is an unrepentant socialist. And they write that the new refugee declaration that he must uh, most assertively has played a role in crafting is socialism, redistribution of wealth, as well as mandatory jobs for refugees. Absolutely written all over it, complete socialist program. Uh, they continue that as if we need another excuse to reiterate once again our demand that the U.S. get out of the United Nations once and for all, this is it. Okay, This refugee crisis is going to destroy this country. This is a redistribution of wealth program. And, you know, send them back to their host countries. Let's get these wars over with. Let's rebuild those nations so these people can go home. All right? That's where they live and that's where they belong. What are your thoughts on this? Comment below. Subscribe for updates. If you like what we're doing, give us a thumbs up and share this report. For the Next News Network, I'm Gary Franchi. It's time to live the life you deserve. Trade Genius offers daily stock market alerts sent straight to your mobile device. We do the research on the market, then we text you when we buy and when we sell. We do all the work. You make the profits. It's that easy. Take advantage of our 70% average win today and try us out for $19.99. Sign up today and start living the life you deserve.